Hey guys, Dave here with Funky Food with Dave. Hi Dave. Today <laughs> is Wednesday, December 21st, 2022. Happy Solstice Day. Shortest of day of the year, but guess what? Everything starts gradually. I think it's like two seconds a day. For a while then it starts jumping up. It starts getting longer. Um, we just got back from dinner at a place we've never tried before. Murdoch's down in, uh, down south of Ludlow here. Very good. Uh, any other things to say, Ben, before we get going into this? Happy winter solstice. Yeah, happy winter solstice. And we're getting rain on Friday. It'll be 50 during the day and drop down to like 8 at night. So everything's going to freeze up like it's a chunk of cement. And then the end of next week's going to be in the 40s. So melt off some of the snow. So again, here, it, here we are for Taste Test Wednesday. And today we are going to try a better known company. Um, called 13 stars we get this sauce when I mean, we're down at the uh, the hot sauce festival let me go ahead and read this this one's called 13 stars tango mango hot sauce better known which I will always support better known uh, it's a four out of five on the heat level all natural um, give back. A portion of our profits go to the U.S. veteran and first responder causes. Always a great thing. Sweet heat, top notes of mango and lime that leads into a fierce heat wave from the habanero peppers. America's Hot Sauce. For recipes and more, check out 13starshotsauce.com. 13 stars, so 13starshotsauce.com. And the ingredients distilled white vinegar, habanero peppers. Mango, sweet onion, carrot, tomato paste, lime juice, spices, and kosher salt. I think this is going to be a, uh, it sounds like this is going to be a vinegar forward sauce. Easily vinegar forward. Um, just by the way, I forgot my, my knife. I think I got it. There we go. Give it a good shake. Very, you can see that it's a very, very thin sauce. This is reminding me of almost a Tabasco style sauce. Oh, yeah, that's a very vinegar forward sauce. But I can smell, I can smell that habanero wine. I can really smell that habanero wine. Yeah, the habanero, the distilled vinegar, I definitely got the habanero I got. I got the lime. I think that must be onion. Oh, yeah, the onion and then a little hint of garlic on it. All right, so let's give this another shake. You can see chunks of pepper in there. Um, but it's a very thin sauce. You can see it on the pour, how thin it is. I think... A little thicker than I thought. Yeah. Hmm. Smells good. It smells really good. Wow. That's a vinegar. Ooh, that's got a bite. Four out of five, so they're saying eight out of ten. I would have put it eight out of ten, but for a habanero sauce, for a habanero sauce, this is hot. Yep, here we go. Uh, I, I'm gonna, <laughs> I haven't had a habanero like me up like this in a while, but my my tolerance is way down. I forgot to tell you, these guys are out of Warren. Rhode Island. I met these guys at the Hot Sauce Festival this past summer down in Hampton, New Hampshire. A bunch of good guys. A couple Air Force vets, I think they were, and an Army. Air Force and Army vets. Whew. For a habanero, honey, I, you won't want to try this. No. Uh, you can if you want to. Nope. I'm all set. For a habanero hot sauce, this has got a bite. I would give this, 
That's pushing a three for me. Huh? Holy shit, talkie. Then the vinegar hiccups. Let's see, it's already gone. Yeah, after the other business I tried the other day, I'm good. I'm not trying anything that's going to light my gums on fire. It's not yeah, fun. If anybody didn't see that video. Well, it's not fun. Please watch it. We had some uh, beef jerky. I haven't given my, uh, hadn't given my heat rating yet. Paula tried to pee and proceeded to be in pain. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, my, my gums, and it hurt quite a while after. That was in good time. I, I initially gave this a three. I'm going to go two and a half. Solid two and a half to three. The heat's already gone. The first thing you get out of this, this is definitely kind of that, that Tabasco style hot sauce, very vinegar forward, um, very habanero flavor. And I got the onion and garlic and some lime out of it. But you get the vinegar right off and the harbor arrow hits you good i yeah two and a half to three on the heat now usually i'm not a huge vinegar forward strong vinegar forward hot sauce guy however i like how that harbor that harbor arrow hits you right at the same time and you get the lime you get the onion and garlic pretty much right at the same time as the harbor arrow and it and it, it's living up to its uh, four out of five, eight out of ten. So I'm giving it two and a half out, two and a half to three. So it's a hot habanero sauce. I give that a seven. I give wow. It a seven. Yeah, I like that for a vinegar forward for a vinegar forward sauce. I like it because a lot of vinegar forward sauces it takes away from all the other flavors. Mm -hmm. This one, all the flavors are right there. That, I mean, the flavors are right there. So, yeah, I'd give this a, I'd give it a seven out of ten on the uh, flavor scale. You know, and I even got a little bit of the mango, but I got the habanero, the onion, garlic, and lime more than that. But I did get the mango. Two and a half, three out on the heat. Two and a half, three on the heat. Seven on flavor. My wife's yawning because oh, she's been she's very tired. I've been very busy today. You're a busy little girl today. <laughs> I have been up since the crack, and then I I have been all over the place. Yeah, so now you can see the seed the seed habanero seed chunks all throughout that sauce. I don't know if you can see it in there. Yep. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know why it's not focusing. I was like, oh, there we go. Good job, honey. It's got the habanero seed chunks in there. I'd give this, uh, yeah, seven out of ten. Yep, it's a good sauce for for a vinegar forward sauce. I would put this. I would, uh, yeah, chicken, chicken all day for this one. <clears throat> Take the heat and give it back. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oops, sorry. Yeah. So, guys, that was the 13 Stars um, Tango Mango Hot Sauce. My 13 Stars Hot Sauce. Nice. Out of Rhode Island. Um, we'll be back tomorrow. I was supposed to do a video last night, but we got... I don't even remember what we ended up doing. We're just... We're so busy. It's oh, very oh, busy. We, oh, we yes! Went, uh, we are officially set up at our first store uh, down in Brattleboro. I don't remember the name of it, Paula. Oh, I'm sorry. You're asking me yeah. Vermont something. <laughs> Vermont. But it's down in um, Emporium. Down in Brattleboro, we're set up with a kind of craft and food store. We're set up next to our friends, uh, Frenchie Blues uh, Barbecue Sauce. There's people that do honeys and jams and all salsa sorts sisters. Or salsa sisters. She's the one that the owns best salsa it. Yep. You can get. Yeah. Um, and then a lot of hand craft, you know, handmade crafts and stuff. Yeah, I had kind of a good time in there. So yeah. we're set up there, and uh, I had a guy stop today at work. He is starting the, um, finally, starting the website. Uh, and we also have we got invited to do. Um, yeah, we got to figure out the name. Of that all thing. the ski areas. We just been so busy that right now I'm just kind of just winging out names, but. The ski areas, it's a gentleman that runs uh, 
doing shows, all the ski areas in the state of Vermont. And it's like you have to guarantee that you do at least four, but I believe there's almost 20 yeah. that so I could choose do, from or 15 southern, or whatever. Southern Vermont ski yep. resorts. Don't and do travel s- two, three hours in the, in the winter, especially if you know about the weather. Gonna be. Yeah, but do some shows. I think that will be fun. So, yeah, we've just, just been busy. But tomorrow, I promise, I will do... Now, Paula thinks this is a bag of weed. <laughs> oh, my God, I keep going, what the heck but is that? This is uh, uh, Tom Bailey's uh, tincture. I promise I'll get that tomorrow, Tom. I've just been so busy. Actually, yeah, we oh, have been way, busy. Tom, once you get to Florida, I need your address. Uh, so, all right, guys. Uh, yeah, so, again, yeah, happy solstice. Uh, take care of yourself. Have fun. Be safe. We will see you tomorrow for a special taste test, uh, tincture taste test. And maybe after a good night's rest, we won't be winging it. (laughs) All right, guys. (laughs) Have a great night. See you tomorrow. Bye.